out of the way. I'm not gonna lie to you guys, those are like 85% of my jokes. All right guys, good night. <laughs> I kid, I kid, I am actually black. <laughs> you know on the way up here, I saw a pack of like a bazooka bubble gum, and I thought to myself, oh look, this is a gum that they had during Jim Crow, that's neat. <laughs> it was like 60 calories and five grams of sugar. Even during those horribly racist times, they still care about their calories. Interesting. <laughs> A lot of white people in there didn't get that joke. All right, <laughs> let's keep it moving. <laughs> oh man, actually my girlfriend is here. Thank you, babe, for coming. Give her a round of applause. Thank you. I've actually actually gained some relationship weight since we've been together. So, you know, to stay in shape, I like to swim. I actually swim so much at the Northeast YMCA, they call me the black shark. Because <laughs> for some reason, every time I get in the pool, white people just seem to swim away. <laughs> Personally, I liked, I called myself the Black Dolphin, but they really didn't like my sound effects. Ah, ah. <laughs> they didn't like it, apparently. They didn't like it. But it's cool, you know, like, I don't know personally what the huge fascination with the 90s are. I mean, really, because to me, it was the era of the token black guy. I mean, let's be honest. Did anyone see the show, Doug? Anyone see the show, Doug? Yeah. Anyone? I mean, let's be real. Even though Skeeter was blue, we all knew he was black. <laughs> And, I, and they even had the audacity to even do it on Spongebob, Squidward. <laughs> I'm gonna be real, cause look, he was cranky, he didn't like his job, and he played the clarinet. That's a brother, people. <sighs> Curses, Nickelodeon, always trying to make our brothers blue, always. <laughs> always, always but actually, that was actually my favorite part uh, growing up, was commercials. Now, like my favorite commercial growing up was, if you want to see the one about the Tootsie Pop with the kids ask, <laughs> How many licks it get, does it take to get the serve a Tootsie Pop? You want to see that one? Yeah. I love his response. He was just like, let's find out. One, two, three. How many licks does it take to get the serve a Tootsie Pop? The world may never know. It's actually 4,080 to be exact. You're welcome, people. I figured that out. I'm going to let you discuss that among yourselves. Y'all don't seem as interested as I thought you would. Damn it. I thought they liked Tootsie Pops, honey. 